A local company that focuses on purifying the air is making a difference in another way. In your community, Syrionics Inc., President Jim Langer, and Mary Tiefenbrunn with the Champaign County Humane Society join me. I'll tell you why they're both here in just a second. But, Jim, let's start with you and Syrionics and the amazing things you guys have been working on with NASA and with air quality. Uh, give us the nutshell about what Syrionics does. Yeah, so we actually build, uh, we build our colorful filters uh, using uh, a technology we built originally for NASA. And so the pink coating on our filter is actually designed to remove toxic chemicals and odors from the air. And uh, we built it originally for NASA spacesuits and for the space station, but we had kind of a surprising discovery several years ago when a friend of mine uh, who's, uh, whose cat was marking and kind of had him <laughs> and his wife at their wit's end uh, regarding the cat was just stressed out because they had a new baby and who wouldn't be stressed sure. out, right? And so we actually made a filter for him using, uh, using the te same technology and that's really how Colorfill was born. And we found that the, the filter removed the odors really effectively and uh, reduced their stress, you know, reduced the cat's stress and, you know, if it didn't save their marriage, at the very least it saved the cat. <laughs> <laughs> right. And, uh, and so that really birthed a, a new direction for us. Uh, you know, we're still you know, passionate about working on you know, big applications like aerospace and working uh, with, uh, with NASA on building filters for them. But since then, we've been really excited about the new direction about working on making filters for homes with pets. For and this is also, uh, you got into the mask business too, right? You're doing some things with the masks that everybody's having to wear? Yeah, so we actually uh, built a face mask uh, a year ago. We started building a face mask. That was really good timing. To, yeah, <laughs> to, to start ad addressing the issue of finding a mask that people would actually be willing to wear. Yeah. Um, and we actually have a, a face mask that we developed for uh, for removing for. Um, uh, non-medical purposes, okay. but it's a great mask and actually uh, won an award from Runner's World for uh, best mask for, uh, for running in. Well, let's talk about the connection with the Champaign County Humane Society. Uh, I believe some proceeds from what you've been doing have gone to benefit them. Let's, let's talk quickly about that and then Mary will jump to you as to how that's impacting the Humane Society. Yeah, so at our core, our mission is to uh, help empower people to, to create you know, welcoming, safe, and clean living spaces for them and their pets. And you know, to take that to the next level, uh, what we you know, realized is we had an opportunity to give back as part of our mission as well. And so we really you know, sought from the beginning to see how, how we could do that. And we saw an opportunity um, you know, as we were launching this product to actually partner to give a dollar back for each filter. And as I understand it, Mary, yesterday you guys got a check. <laughs> well, <laughs> it was a it was a uh, a check to represent a, a uh, ceremonial check. Yeah, ceremonial check. <laughs> that was the word I was grasping for. Um, t uh, that uh, so far, you know, they've they've now maxed out. Uh, they've given us twenty thousand wow. um, dollars over time, and it has been really meaningful to us during this whole um, pandemic. A lot of our fundraising events just kind of fell by the wayside because without you know people being able to get together and businesses in in this community have supported us for years and they're always doing fundraisers throughout the year but uh, again all of that kind of dried up during um, the pandemic and i would imagine the pandemic impacted the humane society in some interesting ways too not just lack of being able to raise funds but, but perhaps having more animals um our actually our population hasn't really been impacted that much okay. we you know animals continued to come in but it, numbers didn't really rise um, but uh, but it impacted the way we operate. We were an essential business, so we've stayed open. But it's been great to have you know one of our business supporters just be able to continue throughout the year. We're still getting checks from from Colorful because yeah. uh, people are still buying air filters. <laughs> well, that's a good thing for for both of you guys. Yeah. And I, I think I could talk about the technology involved in this forever, Jim. Unfortunately, we don't have forever. But thank you for doing what you're doing. I know uh, the Humane Society appreciates it, and uh, we certainly do as well. All right. Appreciate you guys. All right. Thanks so much. If you want more details on how to save a little money on one of these air filters, you see it there on your screen. We'll connect you with all the details about uh, color fill on our website as well. And Syrionics, just go to CILiving.tv.